I'm proud to announce Windows 11. Also, it will probably not run on your PC. Hi there, Brett's bro. As you may know, Windows just released Windows 11, but the bigger news was that Windows 11 probably won't be compatible with your PC. But why? Well, weirdly enough, Windows 11 was announced just after Bill Gates' divorce. Suspicious, isn't it? They say Windows 11 can't run on your PC. What if they don't want it to run on your PC? 8th gen? That's an oddly specific generation of CPU for Windows 11. What if Melinda has a PC with a 7th gen processor? Guilt. Revenge. That's not what I'm gonna talk about today. <laughs> today I'm gonna show you how to bypass those checks and install Windows 11 on any PC. So let's just get into it. <sighs> All right. Before starting this, I'd like to thank Mario who found this method and this video wouldn't have been made possible without him. Check out his tweet, link in the description of course. And if you're installing Windows 11 from scratch, check out my video on how to install Windows 10. It's the exactly same process, except of at the process of installing Windows, you will get the error that Windows 11 is not compatible with your device. So this is where you pause and watch this video. The links and the Windows 11 ESO are in the description, of course. So, now that we are here, click on install now. So let's say you just got the error. What you do is, on your keyboard, type Shift plus F10. A terminal window will appear. There, type regedit and then enter. This will open. Go to this directory, machine, system, setup. Here, right click on the empty space, click on new and key. Rename the key to exactly like this, lab config. Where the L and the C's are capital. Here, right click new DWORD 32 bit value and name the value to bypass TPM check. Enter, right click on it, modify and set the value to 1. OK. Again, new DWORD 32 bit and name the value to bypass secure boot check. Enter, right click on it, modify 1. OK. Now, well, all of this stuff is in the description, so you can just copy paste it. Now close the windows. Go back. Back. Then go next again. So it will recheck everything and bypass those tests. Next. Custom and everything should be okay. And you may continue with the video at this minute. Well, that's all here. Well, here you have it. Enjoy your Windows 11. It will probably break because those checks aren't for nothing, but hey, you're trying it. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like. If you have any questions, comment below and subscribe to become a pro. So bye.